Hi everyone, this is Richard. In this video, let's go over row widgets. So we went over the container. Row basically is the same thing as a container, only it's a row. So look at these images right here, okay? So when we look at a web page, they're in a row here, 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 perfectly lined up all the way. Sometimes we wanna do that on a mobile application as well, right? It depends upon what you wanna put inside of here. So if we think about what it would be, we would have this row widget and these would be child widgets to the row, right? So that's how I would imagine it in my head. And that's exactly how it's presented. So material app, same thing, new row, all right, and then we have the properties. So instead of child, it would be children, right? And they're gonna be widgets, so it's a list. So the brackets right inside of here. Here, I'm just gonna put the Flutter logo. That's kind of a built-in feature, um, built-in property, I guess. It's a built-in thing of um, for an actual widget to have the Flutter logo. We'll see that in a second. Then I'm just gonna have text, new text one, new text two, since that's all we really know how to do at this point in time. Um, and then I'm gonna say const expanded. What expanded means, so if you just, just have this, let's see what this looks like actually. So if we look at it up above, okay, it's just one, two, and three. No big deal, One Flutter logo, the text one, and the text two perfectly aligned one after the other, right? But these are actually separate children. So if you wanna do something with it, for example, if I clicked on this and it disappeared, this child would disappear, not the whole line. So that's the difference between, well, in that case, why don't you just put a space between the two? Because they're actually different widgets altogether. But what if, again, you got a big, much bigger tablet itself or a different thing or you turn it on its side, you would have one, two, and three right inside of here, right? So what I would do, And let's just change this to one, two, three. But what if I wanna do something a little bit different? What if I want to basically space them out? So space them out as much as possible. Well, what I would do is a const expanded. So that's another property of the row that I would say expanded and then put the child within the expanded property. I'm not sure if you would call it an expanded widget. I'm not sure what's actually called, but it's, I think it's more of a property of the widget in and of it, uh, of the um, row widget. So it would basically say you expand them all out to the maximum level. So here, would it be, well, that's upside down. So it wouldn't be expanded out very much, just a tiny bit. Here, it would be expanded all the way to the very, as far as you want it to actually go. I think that's just the limit for, for this particular um, uh, mobile application. So, so that's what we would do. Here we would say text align, text align center, which you could do. In this context, it really wouldn't make much sense to put text align here because there is no alignment, right? Here, when we talk about expanded, if it's expanded out, would it be in the center, the right, the left? Well, depends on what you wanna do. Let's do the right. So it'll be all the way to this side. So it'll be all the way to the side expanded. You can do all the way to the left. So it would be all the way to the left there. So if you can imagine all three would be expanded, it would be all sorted out. This first one, you might wanna um, have text align left. The number two would be text align center, and the number with three would be text aligned right. If that's what you wanted, if you wanted to separate the text as far apart as possible, right? So um, that that's all that really row actually is. Separate the things out, have them, Nice in alignment itself. Whatever you want to put inside there would be children, since by defin almost by definition, a, a row is a container with more than one child inside of there, right? And it's in the horizontal view. All right. Thanks.